and that 666 is about correcting something. What's up everybody? My name is Melanie Rebirth and in this video I want to talk about what it means to see the repeating number 666. Now, ooh, when we think about 666, we think about ooh, negative things, but for the sake of this video, I will be talking about it on a spiritual vibration, not on a conspiracy theory 666 Satan number. I'm not going to be talking about it like that. But I'm just saying that, so if you're a conspiracy theorist or if that's what you came for, by all means, click off. But if you're not, be sure to stay tuned for more. And with that being said, let's get into it. So when I say 666, I want you to think about vibration. So numbers are universal. Numbers are understood all over the world. While we communicate with each other, see, like let's say for example, I speak English, you speak English, so we communicate, that's how we communicate with each other. But as far as how the universe communicates to us is through numbers. That's why numbers is understood all over the world because a one is gonna be a one wherever you go. A two is a two wherever you go. So overstand that and know that this video is from a spiritual vibrational standpoint of the numbers if you have not already be sure to check out my life path number six video that i made i'll leave the link in the description down below so by all means make sure to check that out i also have a numerology life path number playlist where i go through the numbers one through 11 I will get to 1 through 33 which is the master number uh 11 22 and 33 eventually I'll get there it's just depending on what you when you're watching this anyways let's get back on track so with life path well with repeating number 666 we think about vibration and we know that when we see these numbers it's not by coincidence so if you've been seeing 666 a lot or you've been seeing other repeating numbers like 11 11 or 444 or 222 you've been seeing those numbers a lot there's a reason and understand that the spiritual guides the angelic spiritual guides the angels are speaking to you and that's their form of communicating with you why because repeating numbers catch your attention and for the most part most of them are in patterns or sequence of three which we know that three represents complete uh three represents trinity three represents higher three represents god the creator 33 a lot of significant things with the number three and it's a powerful number so why are you getting this in six what does six mean six means it's all about well six is a feminine sign but six is all about development it's all about going i wouldn't say back but it's about kind of fine-tuning things correcting your mistakes it's a it's a kind of a rough number if you think about it a, a, a little bit but it's a necessary number. And I know we've been taught for the most part to, ooh, stay away from 666. But if you've been seeing six, or even if you're a life path number six, or even if you have like a lot of Virgo or things of that nature in, in your in your astrological chart, there's nothing wrong with it. And the more you research and the more studying you do, you're gonna come to the same conclusion. And it's nothing wrong with the number six. So. It's just some people like to do bad things with it. That's for another story for another day. Life path, well, if you're seeing 666, it's because it's reminding you that you may need to make a correction. Six is a very judgmental sign. Six is a very logical, even though I said it was a feminine sign, yes it is, but when you think about it in a number wise, we know that six is critical, it's crucial, it's judgmental, it's organized, it's uh, it has routine to it, yes, 
but it's all about correction too so i like to say this in my videos especially when i'm with if i'm talking about repeating numbers always think about what your intuition is telling you especially at that time especially at that moment when you see 666 and it could be it could be within a split second the more you the more you consciously do that the better you'll get at it believe me and it takes it's going to take practice like i've been seeing repeating numbers for for years now so this is nothing new it, it just happens and the more in tune and the more studying that you do you will you will see repeating numbers a lot like you will see it a lot so understand that 666 is about correcting like something. I said think about what you try to think about what you were feeling in that moment what are some of your emotions and that will base that will kind of be the determining factor of what your spiritual guides are trying to communicate with you now for everybody it's different because everybody is different everybody carries different energies to them everybody may not be operating at the same frequency at at this time or at this or that time it's just we're we're all we're all operating in our own energies so understand that now what I will say is let's say for example if you are feeling happy, if you're feeling inspired, know that this is a critical moment for you to know what your spiritual guides are trying to communicate to you. So let's say, for example, if like I said, you're feeling happy, you're feeling joyful, you'll you'll be reassured that you are you you're going to the next level because six is a it's about completion but it's also about going going back and correcting things now like i said earlier in this video it is it's been kind of programmed in our mind to think about six or 666 as an evil number and that's why i say it's about going back and correcting something or being judgmental or fine-tuning things or doing things that we may have that we may not want to do or we may be avoiding or it, it's a it's a very disciplined sign and this number gets slept on a lot but if you learn how to work with the number six more I guarantee you you'll be able to make more corrections in your life that you may been you may have been ignoring and let's say for example if you're feeling if you're feeling down or you're just or you're feeling or you may be feeling some kind of way know that the universe is trying to communicate with you that it may be time for you to kind of look like take reevaluate your life and that could be you need to that could mean that you need to get more organized or that you know you're being looked at or judged or it could it, it could be you just got done with the you just got done with a difficult test and you may have not done so good on it and you need to make some corrections it's it's just it's, it's this a correction and a a judgmental sign but there's nothing it's a just it's a judgmental number but there's nothing wrong with it and especially if you start using it to your advantage and understand will overstand that if you're seeing these numbers that is the perfect time to speak to your spiritual guides even if even if it's just for a split second and ask them a question and say hey um will you help me make corrections will you help me you know in this situation things of that nature of course your spiritual guides are here for you and if you are watching this video and if you got in this far and listening to my rant just understand will overstand that the universe knows your energy and it, it wants to communicate with you they want to help you it's just about you taking this video doing your research and honing in on the repeating numbers that you're seeing and asking and it could be questions or it could be for help or it could be for guidance or it could be for reassurance 
whatever your intuition or whatever you're feeling at that time it's not by coincidence it it's not just because it happens just on its own when you see repeating numbers it's for a reason and with that being said guys i want to hear what you have to say down below um i know my eyes kind of look chingy just because the sun's out but I want to hear what you have to say below. And with that being said, make sure to subscribe. Check out my Life Path number six video because that will help you understand the number six within itself. Or if you are a Life Path number six, that will help you understand six better too. And with that being said, I'll see you on the next video. Peace.